taking a look at radar. A really interesting radar picture here. Now, some of this is not hitting the ground as you get up into more uh, Warren County and northwestern uh, Northampton County and Halifax counties. But in these blue areas right here, this is where that heavier snow is falling now into northern Durham County as well. Then back here into Chatham County and then Lee County and northern uh, portions slide south a little bit. You can see the rain snow line right through southern pines. This is pretty close to what we've been seeing from reports from viewers. Some folks down in southern pines saying well, we've still got rain south of southern the pines. I had a person right in. Here's Fayetteville over here to the east. It's going to be a while before anything happens in Cumberland County. Now your first alert predictor forecast model by one o'clock. This is showing it spread into Fayetteville and I think by lunchtime into one o'clock that's going to be the timing and it could start off as rain in Fayetteville and notice even by one o'clock it's not into the Goldsboro area yet. those uh, eastern counties and it's going to take a while but here through the metro through the triangle and back to the west heavier snow flying through lunchtime. Then as we go into the afternoon even by five six o'clock we've still got snow around heaviest batches down south. Now I've had a couple of people say when's it going to stop? Well, that all depends on where you are. I mean, some folks will see this. Notice as we run this through six o'clock tonight, it's starting to shut off to the north and west. By nine o'clock, I think it's done through the northern counties, even into Orange County. But even through nine o'clock, you still could see snow flying in those eastern counties. That's why that winter storm warning goes through nine o'clock tonight. So this we have potential to see it snow here off and on all day long through the daylight hours through the triangle. And then as we go through the overnight, the model does try and do one last little push by six o'clock tomorrow morning. Clear skies will be here. Temperatures are going to slam down tonight into the teens and low 20s, and that's going to refreeze everything.